Too close for my liking. The bog squatch is around here somewhere. We just gotta find it and get it out of this battle zone. Yeah, before it becomes bog squatch barbecue. This is like the eighth battle zone the Red Sentients have torched. My skin is starting to get crispy. I still can't figure out what Critus is up to. It's almost like it's trying to flush something out from hiding. Huh? Bog squatch! Just afraid. Huh. Nice work, guys. Let's get this thing through the portal and transport it to a zone where it'll be safe. Whoa! Go figure. This guy's just a baby. Everyone, meet Mommy Bog Squatch. Defensive protocol. That is one ticked off mama. Agora, any idea how we can trap this thing? I was kind of hoping you had something brilliant up your sleeve. Red Sartrons! Protect the baby! Guys, back away. Don't show any fear, and whatever you do, do not corner them. Actually, Agora, maybe we should corner them. Right into the portal. <laughs> Safe to show fear now? Go ahead, big bro. Ah! Spinner, think you can hack into one of these drones and see what they were programmed to look for? No prob. As soon as I finish screaming. <laughs> this is incredible. It appears that Kratos is searching for a living, breathing Magmatrox. Magmatrox? <laughs> What's that, a Norwegian metal band? No. Majestic creatures that used to roam lava-based battle zones by the thousands. Until the Reds hunted them to extinction for their horns. You've been checking out the data logs. The parts about multiverse wildlife, yes. Fascinating stuff. Why'd the Reds want their horns? The horns enhanced their psychic powers. It was a dark time. We were nearly defeated and all the Magmatrox perished. Except for this one. If Kritus finds the Magmatrox... He will destroy it. He will use its horn to enhance his psychic powers and locate me here on Earth. Bye-bye, oh, Earth. And bye-bye, Multiverse. Then we need to find this thing before Kritus does, and protect it. Cool, but where's it at? Kritus is moving sequentially through lava-based battle zones. He's burned through these ones. And that one is probably next. Sherman, Spin, you guys stay here with Tess. AJ, everyone else, mount up. We're going into the fire. Whoa. 
It's like a sauna. It's on fire. In an inferno. Hit me, AC! Bakura, you're the hunter. Take point on this mission. No problem. Hold up. Are we close? We just went from warm to super hot. Literally. Fantastic. These jewels will be perfect for my royal crown. <laughs> Stanford, those jewels are Magmatrox droppings. Oh! Who? Oh! How's it do? You. Ah, uh, guys. It feeds on vulcanite, converts it into energy so it can heal and create magma blasts. The fire breather. Sweet. Unless you're on the receiving end. What's the plan, Agora? We encircle it, herd it away from the lava pools and into a valley so it can't escape. Then we capture it and get it to safety. Looks like the Red Sentients have the same plan. Battle Force 5, let's do some work. I will crush the Magma Drox! with one hit from my Senator! Do not underestimate the power of this beast, Krylox. Flare wheels tracking targets. Resistance formidable. It hasn't felt the power of the Sarcurius yet. <laughs> Take it down. It is wounded. Claws off, Kaibori! Battle Force! Acquiring targets, launching flare wheels. Evasive action! Way ahead of you, Bert! Major KO! It's harder than an avalanche, eh? As much as you want to hit back, guys, don't. We've got to treat this thing with kid gloves.
Disengage! I would if I could! That thing go. We need to find the magma trucks before the humans do. No need to panic, Krylox. When I attacked it, I left a psychic tracking claw in its shoulder. <laughs> Excellent work, Kaiburi. They'll destroy it for its horn. I don't understand why they have to be so brutal. They're red sentience. Magmatrox horns are infinitely dense. They can only be cut by a special red sentient device back on their home world. But it destroys the beast in the process. <gasps> the end of the trail. <sighs> the beast is right around. Here. This Magmatrox has strong survival instincts. I can respect that. The Magmatrox used up much of its energy fighting us and the humans. It will be hungry. Order your drones to destroy any Vulcanite in a 50-mile radius. If the Magmatrox wants to eat, it'll have to deal with these. and burn hunting. They're cutting off its food supply. Zoom, recon update? Couple of Red Sark drones, but no sign of the Magmatrox. Stanford, the Magmatrox is a powerful beast, but without a constant supply of Vulcanite, it weakens fast. Can you echo map this area for any deposits of Vulcanite? Absolutely, provided those drones haven't destroyed all of them. Smart, if we can't follow the creature's tracks, we can follow its food source. There are a few deposits up ahead. I'm uploading the coordinates to your tangler. Thanks, Stanford. Battle Force 5, fall in. Kaiburi's traps! We have company! This hunt is over. No! The beast is weak. Finish it! That's what I do best! Structure, weakness located. That's cruelty to animals! You're a 
about to see cruelty to red sentience. Krylops, Kaiguri! <laughs> Drag our quarry home so we can remove its horn! Kaitrin, let's have a little fun. Stop them before they drag the Magmatrox to their homeworld. Zoom, let's put a hurtin' on these guys. Obviously. <laughs> Finally, Hunter versus Hunter. A real hunter respects nature, respects her quarry, and it's time for you to respect the claw! <laughs> 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 Stanford, AJ, tow the Magmatrox back to our portal zone. I'll clean up this trash. <laughs> you can't protect that Magmatrox. I will have that horn! Guys? <laughs> Kratos wants the horn! Um, obvious? No. <clears throat> In Africa, they cut off the horns of rhinos to protect them. With no horns to steal, <coughs> poachers don't hunt them. So we cut off the Magmatrox's horn and Kratos leaves it alone. <coughs> I thought it was impossible to cut off the horn without that red sentient device. True, but we do have a pretty powerful slicer and dicer. The Rigsaw! Yeah. Ah. Totally! But wouldn't that hurt the Magmatrox? No, the horn is just ornamental. Ugh. Cutting it would be painless, like a haircut. Ugh. Time to give her! Hey, I'm trying to have a conversation here! How does it feel to be an endangered species, Kai Buri? Unite and strike! Let's see how tough this horn is. Tough. Yeah. New plan, guys. Line up the magma trucks while Zoom and I hold off Kritus and Kytrid. We'll figure out how to cut off the magma trucks' horn later. Just get it back to Earth. And in one piece. Make sure you don't accidentally close the portal on it. Guys, that's it. We can use the portal to cut the horn. Nice thinking, Nakura. Okay, steady now. This won't hurt a bit.
Icy Coolers, here I come! Oh, brain freeze! Oh, hurts so good! You are a noble hunter, Ragura. The horn is safe. In time, the Magmatrox will spread through the multiverse and roam as they once did, thanks to you. I look forward to that day. <laughs>